Hello everyone, welcome to Tidy Stat YouTube channel. In this video, let me show you how to use split file in SPSS to analyze groups separately. Split file is an SPSS feature that groups data based on a variable so that data analysis will be performed based on this grouping. When you use this split file command, SPSS temporarily divides your dataset into groups based on the values of one or more variables. Then, any analysis or procedures you run are performed separately for each subgroups. In this dataset, I have 20 data about a group of people's income. And let we split this file so we can do uh, the further analysis based on the region. You see that I have two regions here, that one for rural and two for urban. To split your file based on a specific variable, go to data, scroll down, and click split file. Here, SPSS provides three options for us to split our file. The first one is analyze all cases, do not create groups. It means we don't create group uh, in this case. All analysis will be performed for all data without any particular grouping. This is the default option that SPSS gives for us. The next one is compare groups and when you click it, the group based on field is active and this is where we split our file based on a specific variables and at the third option here, you can also split our file based on the variable but the difference is when we click the search options, the output table will be separated in different table. And at the second option, compare groups, the option will be appear in the same table but different rows. I prefer the third option but first, let's take a look at the second options or the compare groups option. Click the compare groups option and select the variable that will be the basis for the grouping. Let's click the region variable and click the arrow button to move it to group based on field. And after that, click OK. Great, nothing's happened. But you see that at the further analysis, it will be separated properly. You see at the bottom right corner of your SPSS window, it has split bar region field. It means that your data is split by the region variable. You need to remember this because your further analysis will be split always by the region. Now, to prove it, go to Analyze and let's choose one of uh, statistical analysis here. And for the easy options, I choose Descriptive Statistics and then select Descriptives. Here, let's select the variable that we want to analyze. We want to analyze the income variable. Click the arrow button and click the options to set the output that will appear on the output window. Check the mean, standard deviation, okay. You can add another option that you want. Click continue and then click okay. Great, now you have a different analysis of your uh, data based on specific variable. And in this case, we are successfully separated the output based on the region you see at the first row is based on rural the second row is urban and rural have uh, 11 data meanwhile urban have 9 data SPSS also calculates the mean and the standard deviation differently for urban and rural next let's split the file by organize output by groups option go to data and select split file great now click organize output by groups option and then click ok and let's do the next analysis still for the descriptive statistics go to analyze descriptive statistics and then select descriptives here and just click ok now you'll see the differences between the compare groups option and the organize output by groups option this third option will separate your table properly based on the subcategory that you have at the categorical variables. This will make your data display in each table neater and easy to understand. If you want to undo the grouped process, you need to reset 
the whole split file process and to do this let's get back to the data view and go to data split files and then click reset and click ok and you see that at the right bottom of the corner of your screen your split file field here that appear when you split your file is gone it means that your next analysis will not be grouped and it will be performed as usual let me show you here this is the usual analysis that is not included the grouping process that's it see you in another video